Hello everyone, not dead yet, and today is the last day before I leave for my trip. I am just doing some last minute packing, as you can see. I don't know if you saw. Uh, boop. Last minute packing before my trip, and uh, tomorrow I leave. I am very excited. I'm also very tired. I got my second dose of the microchip yesterday, and I'm feeling incredibly drained, but we soldier on. So, next time you see me, I will either be on my way to the airport or already at the airport, depending on whether or not I decide to take out my camera and film tomorrow. But we will see in the next couple seconds. Uh, but yeah, little update. Until next time, or at least until next edit. Okay, so it is the next day. It is currently roughly 10 to 6 a.m. And the reason why I'm up so early, I actually got up at 5.30, was because you're supposed to arrive at the airport around two hours before your flight, and my flight leaves at 9.40. But I wanted to give myself a little bit of extra wiggle room of time in case um, some unexpected things happen at the airport due to COVID screening and whatnot. So yeah, um, I just got out of the shower, I am going to get myself dressed and all do my hair and whatnot, and the next time you see me, I will be waiting at my gate. Okay, so I'm at the airport now. Um, everything went relatively smoothly, I ran into this really grumpy lady at check-in who got mad at me for the pillow. I don't know if you guys can see it. There we go. The pillow on my carry-on bag. She was like, oh, there's no way that's going to fit or whatever, and I'm like... I just have to uh, take it off, like I plan to use it, I don't plan to put it underneath my seat, I plan to use the pillow and blanket uh, on the airplane, but anyway, uh, after that I had a little bit of a scare with my ankle weights, uh, the people in checked luggage uh, kind of talked about whether or not they should let me through, but they ultimately did, so that is great, uh, and I am well on my way, I will talk to you guys later, I don't know if I'll film when they start boarding or not, um, uh, but hey, we'll see what happens. All right, so they started boarding now, so that's exciting. Uh, one interesting thing, and I guess it stands to reason given the state of the world and all that, but this is the emptiest I've ever seen airports. Like even with the stoppage I did where they searched my bag and, and made me wait for the weights and everything, um, I zoomed through check-in and security. Like, uh, new. So that's really fun. Um, I... Uh, Hope that the camera is picking up on all of this. Uh, audio is going to be a bit interesting. But anyway, yeah, I'm probably going to put the camera away now and get ready to board. Okay, so I just got off the plane. Nice, like, two-hour flight. Slept for the vast majority of it. Uh, when I woke up, they were serving drinks, and I tried to watch a movie. Too bad all the new releases suck more ass than me on a Saturday night. But I went to the kids section and watched about half of Toy Story 4 because I haven't seen that movie yet. So now I'm walking through Toronto Airport and my next goal is to get to Chicago. So I have to run through US Customs and uh, yeah, I think I got about an hour and a half to do that. Hopefully my check-in and or uh, my security goes as smoothly as I did back in my hometown. So, until the next update. Okay, so this is a quick one. I made it through security just in time for boarding, which is nice. A little bit scary, cutting it close, but we like to live close, right? Uh, I ended up leaving my change purse at security by accident, and by the time I realized I was already well past, so it wasn't worth going back for like $4. But, yeah, uh, trip's going well so far, and I'm super excited to uh, uh, see where this goes. Ho hope everything continues to go as smoothly as it has. Here's a little bit of a look out the gate. Anyway, I got a board. And we have officially boarded. And we're going down. We are in a cloud currently. That's cool. Look at that. I wonder we'll come out of it. Okay, so the plane just landed. Um, we are now pulling into the gate, and um, yeah, uh, next I fly to go see Musket, the undisclosed location, if you will. Uh, the only issue with that is I will be staying in Chicago for about two and a half hours, but that's fine, at least I will not have to run 
from one end of the airport to the other with like 25 pounds strapped to my back like I did when I was in Toronto. So, uh, next update, whenever I feel like it. Soon may the wellerman come to bring us sugar and tea and rum. One day when the tongue is done, we'll take our leave and go. She had not been two weeks from shore when down on her a right whale bore. The captain called all hands and swore he'd take that whale in tow. Look at that. Soon may the wellerman come to bring us sugar and tea. I am going to gate 23B. Hey look, quality journalism. Bingo. Okay, so I have no idea what's going on here, but uh, I'm keeping my fingers crossed that I don't have to stand in all of these lines. Well, guess I'm about to find out. All right, from the looks of things, I actually get to skip that massive line and I'm walking this way, so that's kind of nice. You know, it's really interesting because normally, um, I'm talking to the camera right now, but if this were a normal trip and I was just by myself, I'd be saying all this to myself. And I, I talk to myself a lot. So at least now I can say I'm talking to the camera and it makes me look a lot less like a weirdo and uh, a psycho or whatever. So yeah, instead of uh, rambling to myself, I get to ramble to you guys as well as the camera. So that's nice. I'll uh, keep you updated as I kind of figure things out. Oh look, a telephone. It'd be great if I could use that. Too bad I left all of my change in Toronto. Okay, so this is really interesting. Look at this vending machine. It sells like fresh, like farmer's market jar stuff. I have never seen anything like this before. Let me know if you guys have. Okay, so my flight leaves in about 45 minutes and I am getting hungry. So you know what that means, it's time to eat. And if you know me, you will know that I pack my own lunch because there is no way in hell I'm eating airport food. One, it is horrible for you. Two, it is way too expensive. And three, this is way better. So what do I have? Here I have three slices of homemade pizza and four slices of French toast. Um, I cannot wait to eat them. Uh, I'll show you what they look like if you guys are interested. And uh, yeah, that'll be that. All right, so here's what the pizza looks like. This looks better than I remember it being. I am hungry and I'm gonna get into this. All right, so here's the French toast. Pizza's down. I am getting kind of thirsty now, but I would rather die of thirst than pay $4 for a water bottle. So wish me luck. Uh, after this, I'll probably be boarding and that'll be it for Chicago. So apparently my only entertainment is linked to the Delta, not Delta, United Airlines app, which I need to download and I didn't. So, uh, I, and that's the only form of entertainment on this flight, so it doesn't look like I'll be having any entertainment on this flight. Um, a couple of people tried to help me with their data and that didn't work, so, uh, it's fine though, it's only about an hour and a half flight, I can listen to music the whole way through, but, uh, damn. So I asked the flight attendant if they had, like, a plug-in that I could use to charge my phone, and she said, no, not back here, only row 21 and above. And I was like, oh, right, I forgot I'm flying poor as fuck class. Okay, bear with me, because I thought I was done with this, but I'm obviously not. How can you have your phone, tablet, or mobile device, or whatever, be the only form of entertainment on your flight, and not give anyone from 22 and behind a place to charge their phones if it dies? Like, come on. Okay, so we have successfully survived the flight from Canada to, uh, Redacted, but... Uh, now all I have to do is go get my checked-in luggage and then finally meet the person I flew all the way to the States to meet. That is very exciting. Honestly, I can't wait. Um, I'm, it's been a lot of fun. Very tiring day. Been up since 5 in the morning, but uh, with a couple naps, I slept through most of that flight. So, I'm, don't fe I'm not feeling too bad, but... Uh, yeah, as of now, it's time to figure out where the hell I go to get my luggage. Look at that. That is so cool. Look at that beautiful sunset. So, uh, baggage claim right here. Jeez. Look at that big flag. Oop. I am very 
very excited for what's to come right now. Okay, so I'm gonna be real with you guys. I actually shut the camera off so I could go back and check that little spot where I set up to make sure all my bags were packed to make sure that I didn't forget anything because I was super paranoid that I did. You guys ever do that? Of course you do. You guys are just as paranoid as I am. But hey, it's better to be a little bit cautious and not forget anything or lose anything than be overly lax and forget something, right? So, oh, wow, that was easy. There's baggage claim right there, right through these revolving doors. Let's go. Ooh, fancy. Uh, All righty. Actually, I think that's, nope, that's not my luggage. But uh, now I just try and find my luggage and we go from there. Okay, so that was the wrong carousel. Apparently I have to go to carousel one, which is upstairs, which is this way. See what happens. So I just asked someone and apparently baggage claim is all the way down this hall. Why are airports always such a maze? Hey, here we are, carousel one. Let's go. Let's go. Okay, so it turns out that I didn't even have to go look at the carousel. They had already taken all the bags off of it. I just had to go to a that little United shop there. I don't know if you guys can see it. I'm holding the camera. Weird. There it is. So that little shop there. And um, I had to go pick it up. But I got it, and now all I have to do is uh, talk to Musk and figure out where the heck he's picking me up. So yeah, that's uh, the update. Okay, so apparently I have to go to Concourse A, which is where Musket is picking me up. And I asked someone how to get there, and it is a freaking maze. I have to go down a hallway, take a, two rights, one right after the, the second right down the hallway, and then take another right down an escalator, go through security, take the train to another part of the airport, um, past the glass structure. It is a maze to get around here, but we will figure it out because I don't really have much of a choice. Uh, I will not be able to really vlog as much as I was in the other airports because I have two bags now that require me to use the handles and so I do not have a third hand. But uh, I'll keep you updated as much as I possibly can. Okay, so apparently Josh doesn't know his way around the zone airport. Uh, apparently, Concourse A. I have to go through security for that. So uh, I talked to someone, they, they told me to tell him to meet me at South Terminal, which is where I currently am, I think. This is after, wait, is, is this even on? Yes, it is. After fucking two hours, I finally meet this guy, and he makes fun of my setup. I, I'm fucking poor. <laughs> you got that setup? I, That's a single camera, bro. Yeah, it's a, this yeah. This my setup. Oh, really? Yeah. Your setup's more expensive than mine. I got this for $100 off Kijiji, okay? I, my, my setup consists of a $400 laptop I got on sale, a Yeti mic I got on sale for half off. That's actually good. Yes, a $100 camera, and that is it. So yeah, fucking two hours and I finally meet this guy. He get, who gets lost in their own airport? Bro, who the fuck is... you were on the opposite side of where you told me. I told you, I was at the I south... I thought you said Weiss. South Terminal. <laughs> I thought you said Weiss, bro. Oh my I god. I tried to find That's you. That's West, Patrick. <laughs> You're fired. <laughs> That's Dear god. I don't remember it ending um, like that. Fucking... Okay, hold on, hold on. Nicholas is texting me. <laughs> oh, okay, I have on. proof that you're uh, doing illegal activities. I can now report you to the police. That's BS. You can text while not driving. Fair enough. Well, I'm, actually, it is illegal, but don't worry. I, I'm, should I put this in the video? Uh, I should just blur well, it out. if you don't disclose the state, then it could be legal. Okay, cool. Yeah, so, so we're in China right now. <laughs> we're in China right now, yeah. <laughs> actually, no, we wouldn't be able to record. We? I don't know. You can't show it. Uh, actually, if we were in China, we'd be able to drive on the sidewalk. I'm not kidding. What? And uh, my, but motorcycles don't have to stop for red lights. So me, uh, my dad, and a local all fit ourselves on a bike. And my, I was scared they were gonna kill us. It was like, oh my god, we're going. Like, there's a red light. We're still going. Okay, we're going. We're ripping sixty down a back lane. Okay, great. <laughs> Yeah, it's, yeah, you know. I don't feel so bad about holding my phone while in park, basically. Yeah, exactly. I'm gonna have to shut this off now, though. Wait, hold on. Um, okay, yeah, what? No, no, not you. Oh, okay. I was talking to myself. All right, yeah, I'm shutting this off now. Wait, don't shut it off. All right, fine. Yeah, I'm gonna use your battery up. Yeah, I've got, well. You can't uh, record evidence. <laughs> 70 minutes of battery left with four hours and five minutes on my SD card. Okay, I think I have to cross these tracks. 
we're going on the other side of the tracks. You ain't from around here. You don't know nothing about this. <laughs> Neither do I. Been... Apparently not, if I go by how you uh, navigate the airport. Listen, I told you. I haven't picked anybody up from the airport. So you, even if you've been here before, you should have an idea of where to fucking go. Uh-uh. Uh-uh. What was with that dance? Bro, that's the, that's the Trump dance. Actually, it's not really. It's supposed to be like... Oh, okay. <laughs> fucking God. <laughs> okay, I'm shutting this off now because I don't want to say something bad and can't get myself cancelled even though I can just edit it but out. yeah, yeah, I was about to say, just cut it out. No. Bro, why do you think I cut every 10 seconds? Because I use profanity? I, no, no. Oh, no, no, I just, there's, I just okay, slander there's everybody. This, if you watch my uh, ice bath video, there's a part that I bleep out and it's like there's something I could not keep in for YouTube. Mm. And so I'm, I'm just talking, my friend in the back just says something that I cannot keep in. And I'm like, wait, oh. Wait, can you tell me what it was after you shut off the camera? Oh. Uh, do you remember? I, re I definitely remember. <laughs> Anyway, I'm gonna shut off the camera now. We have literally been driving around for like the past 40 minutes looking for a working gas station. Like, I... <laughs> this is literally Twilight Zone shit. Like, we... It took him two hours to get to the airport because of the maze that... <laughs> of that the airport is. We've gotten lost in like the deep south. Cause I... Like, you have to admit, every no. gas station is like, Yeah, literally every gas station just doesn't work. It's pitch dark. Like, there's like hardly any street lights. And the street lights that are around are so dim that you can't see anything. And uh, there, there was just some random fog. Like, it's not even foggy here. We just go through this random patch of fog. Like, what is this Twilight Zone shit? Oh, don't, uh, don't get the license plate. Oh, I don't know if I did or not. I'll edit it in post. Yeah, Okay, so we are at apparently the only gas station that Musket says, this is not focusing, that Musket says will work. You're about to watch either a man's dreams become reality or you're gonna watch Musket break and you're gonna watch a broken, broken man. I'm gonna mask my feelings, trust me. I have, yeah, I have, I have, um, I have watched this man slowly lose his sanity over the course of like 40 minutes. Whoa. He was already on the brink when he showed up after driving around the same airport loop for two hours. It's asking me to insert my card after I already inserted it. Damn, let me help you. Uh, what, what's the numbers in the front? And the, watch this guy get out, fill up, and drive away. Yeah, and then I go over and it's like, oh, sorry, we just ran out. <laughs> that happened, again, that happened, in, that happened in the airport. How the hell does a Burger King in the airport run out of burgers? Says, please see cashier. That actually might be a thing because, um... I know it's a thing, but like... I feel like if I go in there, they're gonna be like, Oh, sorry, we just closed. <laughs> We're about to find like, out. When you guys open? Oh, permanently. I'm like, oh. Okay. If you, okay, if this, like, I'll seriously, if you want to just spend the night in the hotel room, you're well... I'm gonna turn off the camera. But, uh, I just saw like the stereotypical gangster choice of two, yeah, two of them. Yeah, I know. They got their pants down by their thighs. And, oh my god. No. <laughs> oh, this is going to be a really interesting vlog. Hey, we did it. The gas isn't in the car yet. <laughs> the gas isn't in it. Once the gas is in the car, then I'll leave it. Then you, you turn the ignition, the car just blows up. <laughs> Card declines. <laughs> this is such a joke. Oh my god. <laughs> this is such a joke. What? Did you need what? me? What's up? No. Do you need me to pay? No, dude. I, bro, I'd rather you just hand it. <laughs> <laughs> this is why you guys need to stop skipping ads. Look at how poor this man is. He can't afford That's gas for his car. Okay, look. Right. You say Apple Pay or something? Oh my god. <laughs> Listen, I've got fifty dollars cash. Guess in... what my phone is. I've got fifty dollars cash in my wallet. Okay, can I pay you back? Yes. Okay. No, you can't. Fuck you. Right, come on, please. Okay, here, hold on. Here, hold. Here, take the camera. Oh my gosh. Hey guys, welcome to the vlog. 
You got What's idea. up, little gangsters? <laughs> oh my gosh. Bro, this is so bad. Uh, here, here's 50 bucks cash. Oh. That is amazing. What kind of host are you making the guest pay? You know what? I'm gonna expose you. I was secretly recording the <laughs> Go ahead. I stand by everything I said. That's true. And I respect that. Thank you. Alright, so... Anything I say about anybody... Oh, shit. That's on camera now. I gotta... <laughs> just be like, go ahead. I'll, I'll just bleep it out. Oh, dude. This is so bad. I made my guess. Why don't you pull away your car? It's <laughs> like... <laughs> oh, gosh. No. Everything's going wrong. I love how the first $55 I've spent was giving you money. <laughs> What? The first five was rightfully losing so a bet. Yeah, first five was losing a bet. I'm not used to holding a camera like for this. Yeah, I, I, I you're like pointing at the ground. <laughs> Basically okay. just audio. Oh, <laughs> Is this how they do it? They're like, hey guys. I don't know, because they have those fancy to my video. cameras. So it's like, <laughs> yeah. like, I don't know how, like, I, I have to like, it's so weird too, because I like to look at myself, so I put the screen in. Oh wait, you want the camera? Uh, Okay, just okay, not to pop the thing please up. Please do not get that license plate. We're cutting out. Yeah, no, I'll I'll figure it out. People are brain dead. Really. Yeah, no, I'll. Okay. So what I can do is I'll even send you the video before I upload it, and you can let me know. Okay. Oh yeah, yeah, that would work better. Because little do I know, you show my full social security number, and I'm like. Okay. Have you okay? Have you actually seen the video I made announcing we're meeting? Uh, I saw bits and pieces, but I was rushing to pick you up. Are you <laughs> fucking kidding me? I've been behind on everybody's videos, bro. I can't even keep up. You're, you're the main focus of that one. You figure you'd make it a bit of a priority. Bro, well, I could not. The priority was picking you up and I couldn't even do that. And Dude, I, I thought that video has been out for like a week. I told you I'm behind. I haven't watched Greg in years. I haven't watched <laughs> Remington in weeks. I haven't watched anybody ever. Chat jokes on you. I haven't watched Remington in months. Here we go. Check it out. Oh. Well, we turns, out you turns out you pressed the wrong button. It's like the worst quality gas. I don't know. I don't even care at this point. Okay, look. I haven't watched Remington in weeks. I haven't watched him in months. Get on my level. We got gas. I can't believe it. It's like, it's such a foreign entity at this point. Uh, it's so pure. <laughs> Watch it overflow and hit you in the head. Alright. Where's my bodyguard? Don't let it happen, please. <laughs> I have to really listen to this audio because I don't want to expose us. <laughs> it's like how? What do we say? Well, you know the people we've been. I, I can't. I'm still recording. I can't say too much. Well, why? What? What did you say that was like compromising? Just the opinions we've shared about people. We didn't say any names. Oh well. Yeah, we did. Oh, okay. Yeah, there, there are two names in particular. I might leave this part in just to have people guess. Exactly. Well, look, we're genuine people. We're not. We're not putting on a mask. You know, we're we're being straight up. You know. We're not lying over here, it's okay. No, I'm I'm literally the guy where it's like, I heard you say, I heard you were talking shit about my back, or behind my back, and I'll be like, yeah, uh, you're going to have to be a little bit more specific because I've been talking so much shit that I have no idea what you're saying. <laughs> exactly. Oh, 40 bucks, let's go. Let's oh. go, <laughs> the baby. <laughs> With the, oh. the baby convertible. <laughs> Bro, it's so beautiful. It's just, I, I just want to savor this, you understand? Like, we, how many gas stations has it been? It's been like seven or eight. Yeah. And here it is, the big day. Slowly approaching. I bet it would have been better if you used your own money. It would have, honestly. <laughs> now I feel like I'm just a poor beggar on the street. You are, though. Shut up, I picked you up. Alright? Well, take it easy. I could have walked to my hotel before you showed up, though. <laughs> Shut up, no, you, okay, would you have walked in that forest alone? Like, oh, I know you can box, but animals? We got some crazy animals around here. I, uh, my friends used to joke around that I was the guy that would go camping just so I could fist fight a bear. Okay, uh, okay, we're good. Great, let's drive off. I'm gonna give you, no, I'm gonna give you the 50 bucks before we drive off. How? Oh. And on the next installment of going to every place in this state, aside from my hotel room. What the hell? Look! Chase fraud, we decline. <laughs> they thought it was fraud? That's how poor you are. You're not no, that you're is so poor. dead. I just spent 300 yesterday on earbuds. You guys are stupid. That's probably, that's probably why you don't have what? enough money to what? buy for gas. That is stupid. I always know my account. How much is in it? Always. Nah. Literally. You're lying. All right, let's see what how much money are you don't dox me. Don't how, dox me. How much money are you siphoning from Greg? Let's see. Oh, yeah. 
I got I can't bite the hand that feeds me, right? Yeah, exactly. <laughs> that oh. lovely double joke. Okay. Oh uh, my god. Okay, it's good to be in the car. Let's check the gas. Actually, no. I, I'm not gonna use a single. <laughs> I'm not using this for idling. I'm not using. I did not think I'd have this much energy this early in the morning. To be fair, I did sleep for the vast majority of my flights. Okay, wait, wait. If yes, you will not be charged unless you try again. If no, okay. Dude, what? So you actually could have paid if you just checked your texts. Oh, but you left your phone in the car. <laughs> yeah. Uh, okay. Well, look, it's fine. Uh, so, what are your payment methods? I have Chase Quick Pay. I have. Apple cash? Can't you just give me cash at late, some later point? I won't forget, and there's no big deal. No, I like to pay people on site. I don't like to own anyone anything. I'm my own man. I'm Remington James. Okay, <laughs> Venmo, I cash have, app, Again, I have PayPal. PayPal, but the PayPal takes... Wait, does it take away? Because I'm Canadian. No, it sends me the... <laughs> it sends me the... Here, I actually want... Let me figure it out. Because I don't don't pay me yet, because I want to figure it out. I, I want to make sure that I have the right method. So. Sorry, bro. I already sent you money. What? Wait, I, how did I? I'm like, how did you know? But then go to my YouTube channel and do donate to them. Yeah, exactly. Thanks for the great videos, bud. And the gas. And the gas. <laughs> oh, oh my, my gosh. gosh. Bro, this is great. Okay, I'm actually kind of glad everything went wrong. Because imagine if everything was so smooth, it's like, okay, here's the airport. Okay, yeah. here's no, the this is, this is what, uh, what This is one hell of, this, again, like I said, this is going to make one hell of a vlog. Yeah, dude, what the heck. I'm still, and I still have 60 minutes in this battery. And three, Oof. and four hours. I Basically, think you, I think you're gonna be good. Oh my gosh, I'm gonna have to wake up five. Four again, hours sleep. Again, if you want to just chill in the hotel, because again, you'd have to drive back home. If you don't want to drive, you're welcome to stay in the hotel. Hmm. It's so tempting. Hmm. Depends on the hotel. <laughs> Wait, are you still recording? Yes. Bro, cut that. <laughs> no. Cut it! No, cut, no, cut it! That, that is cut it! You that, son of a That's gun. gonna be a YouTube short. No, I refuse. <laughs> No, because look, 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 I'm trying. Okay, you actually have to cut the camera for what I'm about to say. Sure, okay, hold on. Uh, well, you can be like, okay, I cut it, and I see a flash. I'm like, here, no. look, 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 watch, watch. Cutting it now in three, two, one. Okay, so this is our road that we're traveling on right now. To the hotel? Yep, yeah, to my hotel. Okay, let's, let's get that track going. Twilight Zone, um, shit continues. <laughs> like, this has been the weird, I've been on a lot of weird trips, and, um, and I'm not talking about like drug trips, I don't do drugs. I've been on a lot of weird voyages and this is definitely one of them. Okay, I see light. All right, three in the morning, he finally left. Um, it's gonna be one hell of a vlog to edit together. I'm tired, I've got a long day ahead of me tomorrow. I'm gonna go shower and get some sleep. Uh, but until next one, and believe me, there's gonna be a lot. I am not dead yet, and if you are not either, there is always a tomorrow waiting for you. I am very, very excited for the tomorrow waiting for me.